So I'm going into the lab now on this beautiful morning to try to figure out my PCR reaction, which just does not want to seem to work. It's quite frustrating because it really should work, my PCR reaction, but I guess it's my job today to figure out why it's not working. I mean, part of my problem is that I might not be running enough PCR reaction on the gel to visualize it, you know, to check to make sure that my PCR band is where it should be. So it's a catch-22, though. I, I, I want to save PCR products for my next step of the reaction, and so I want to save as much as I can. But then if I'm not running enough DNA on the gel, I might not see it. So what I'm going to do this morning is run more PCR reaction on the gel, like a lot more, and see if I get anything. Otherwise, I might have to re-transform my bacteria and start from scratch, which would be a huge pain in the butt. So let's hope I don't have to do that. But yeah, totally gorgeous morning on campus today. First, I'm going to get some ice to let my PCR samples defrost slowly. And here are my PCR reactions from last night. Go, defrost! And now I just need to wait for my gel to set. With my samples loaded, it's time to run this baby. The gel runs for 40 minutes, and... Nothing! I didn't get anything. Okay, so back to the drawing board. I'm going to run another PCR with a positive control and this mysterious reagent called Q-Solution, which might make my reaction run smoother. Sup dudes, I'm gonna turn you into a PCR reaction. Whoa, that was super quick. The red dye you see is the PCR buffer. Quick vortex so everything's mixed together, and spin them down we go. Load the samples into the PCR machine. You know, maybe push a few buttons, and hope for the best. So my PCR reaction is running, and that'll take about two hours to run, and I'll probably store it actually overnight at negative 20 degrees Celsius, and then run on a gel tomorrow to see how things went. And I'm gonna go back to my apartment a little bit, maybe spend some time on the green, and um, do some other lab-related things in the meantime. So let's hope this PCR reaction works, yeah? That'd be nice.